Hey everybody, this is the Math 10C Polynomials Review Package. This is Written Response 5E. Um, I'm supposed to represent this product using algebra tiles. And again, even if you're super comfortable with the, the algebra here, you still need to be able to represent this visually here. So here, let's go. X minus 3, what would that look like? Well, okay, X is going to be that long, that long tile there. I don't know how many units long. It's X, that's one wide. And then minus 3, just minus three little blocks here, and remember to, to illustrate a negative, I'm just going to use a shaded in little block there. So I'll know that this is positive, but these are negative. X plus four, okay, because remember I'm interpreting multiplication here as a, an area calculation. So I'm going to go along the length here. And that'll be four units right there, so X plus four. And so now we're going to figure out the area of the corresponding rectangle. Well x by x will give me a square, that's x squared. And then I've got a unit by an x here, so this will be a, an x tile. Another one, another one, and another one. Here, I've got an x by a unit, but these units are negative, so remember a positive by a negative, you've got to remember that that's going to be negative. This is going to end up being negative. And that one is also going to end up being negative. Okay. Now, I've got units by units here, except these are negative. So when you multiply these all out, these are all going to be filled in squares because a negative times a positive is a negative. So every single one of those guys is going to be a negative filled in little square here. So now I just got to add this all up, or, or sorry, write it all out here. I have got a single x squared. I have got four positive x tiles and three negative x tiles. Now that's going to cancel with that one. This one's going to cancel with this one. This one's going to cancel with this one, which leaves me with just a single positive x tile. And then what have I got here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve of those little negative units there. So that's how we represent that, x squared plus x minus 12.